This is gate 2006 question. A, a finite state machine that is given to you and question is asking the expression, the equation for next state in terms of what is current state and the input variables. So you have two input variable x comma y and we want to write this as plus as a function of okay so this is the question as a function of what is your present state and what are the input variables okay so this equation we have to write so basically next state equation we have to find okay and in previous questions many times we have done does done this okay so next state equation we have to write okay so this is a very simple question now let's solve it so either you can write the next state equation from the state diagram or you can write from the state table here state diagram is given you can directly use this state diagram to write the next state equation okay so let me write uh, using the state diagram directly let me write it okay so you can notice that whenever you are writing from the state diagram whenever you are writing next state equation from state diagram if a state diagram is given to you okay because now okay how can we do this so from this state diagram how can we write the equation for next state so i told you that whenever you are writing next state equation for from state diagram this is your variable what is this variable this variable is basically next state variable i can say okay so this is your next state variable okay now i am i want to write an equation for this next state variable then what i have to do just check when this will become one means when the next state will become one just focus on that just focus on when the next state will become one okay so you can notice that this is the point okay this is the point if you want to write the equation directly from state diagram from state diagram if you want to write any equation any equation you want to write from the state diagram then all you have to do just focus on the variable when this variable is becoming one okay so this is your next state variable when will this become one okay so you can notice there are two choices if you are already in this state if you are already in this state one we are focusing on when the next state will become one okay if you are already in this state one then the input should be one okay so i am saying that if you are in state one if s is one then input should be one then input x should be one okay so you can notice if you are in this state okay there are two inputs x comma y there are two inputs i am saying that if you are in this state s equal to one so if you are in this state s s equal to one then i can say that the input should be one the, the, see this x should be one okay or or if you are in this state if you are in this state s equal to zero means if you are in this s g s equal to zero state means s bar okay if you are in this state means s equal to zero so i am saying if you are in this state s equal to zero then this y should be zero then this y should be zero okay so that's it this is your answer okay so the answer will be sx plus uh, sx or s bar y bar okay so here answer will be option a so this is how you can solve the question is very 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 simple okay and this is how you can solve from the state diagram i hope you got it remember from the state diagram if you want to write any equation for any variable then what you can do just focus on when that variable will become one so just focus on when the next state will become one okay now you can notice either you are in this state if you are already in state one then the x should be one or or if you are in state zero then y should be zero okay so this is the equation for next state from the state diagram you can also use the state table what you can do if you if you understood this if you understood this then that is very good okay very good but if you did not understand this okay then what you can do you can convert this state diagram into state table so let me convert into a state table okay so the state table you can create so there are basically okay you have what you have you have state this is your current state this is your input x comma y okay then what you can do so you can make a state table like this okay so these are your two inputs and this is your next state this is this is your actually this is the next state okay so now i am saying that 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 okay so you can notice so let's make the state table now if your current state is s input is x comma y then what will be your next state so you can notice if your current state is s s equal to 0 if this is your current state s equal to 0 then if the input is y equal to 1 okay you are okay so you can notice if this is your current state okay and input is y equal to 1 then x is don't care we don't care about x now x is don't care okay now the next state will be again 0 okay so the next state again will be 0 similarly if you are in this state and y is 0 
then x is don't care if you are in this state and y is 0 then x is don't care we don't care about the value of x and the next state will be 1 similarly if you are in this state and if x is 0 if if x is 0 you are in this state as equal to 1 and if x is 0 then next state will be as equal to 0 and y is don't care we don't care about y and the next state will be as equal to 0 similarly if you are in this state and x is 1 then y is don't care and the next state will also be 1 so this is your state table you can notice okay so these are don't cares okay remember these are actually don't cares means if you are in this state if you are in this state 0 if if your state is 0 and y is 1 then x is don't care we don't care about the value of x the next state will definitely be 0 okay so this is how you can do this is your state table now what you can do now you can write the state equation okay so from this what you can create you can create the k map so you can make the k map for this uh, state variable because this is the equation we want okay we want the equation for s plus so you can make a k map for s plus okay and you have so you this s plus this is a function of uh, three variables the current state and the input x comma y okay so how can you make the uh, how can you fill the entries of k map you can very easily see okay just focus on where s is one okay so s is one when uh, uh, s plus is one when s is zero and y is 0 when s is 0 y is 0 then we don't care about the value of x and s plus will be 1 so i can say that when s is 0 y is 0 okay when s is 0 and you can notice when y is 0 okay so in these two situations s will de s plus will definitely be 1 we don't care about the value of remember s 0 y 0 in this situation definitely s plus will be 1 okay x value doesn't matter similarly when s is 1 and x is 1 when s is 1 okay and you can notice x is 1 then in this case also your s plus will become 1 okay now you can make the from the k map what you can do you can just okay you can write the expression you can write okay so you can write the expression like this okay so finally the answer will be what okay so what is this this is just x s bar okay and what is this this is y bar s bar okay so you can notice okay so sorry this is x s okay so this is x s and this is y bar s bar okay now the final answer will be s is equal to x x or y bar s bar so this is your answer so from the state table also you can write okay so this is your state table from here you can directly write what you can you can see just focus on when s plus is one just focus on when s plus is one okay when s plus is one you can very easily see s is 0 y is 0 means s bar y bar or s is 1 x is 1 s is 1 x is 1 so like this also you can do you don't have to create k map don't create k map you can directly write okay you can directly get this equation from the state table or you can create the k map or you can create or you can directly write from the state diagram so this is actually the best method because if state diagram is given to you then directly use it okay you are writing the equation for next state so what you can do just focus when the next state will become one okay the next state will become one if you are in if you are in state s s equal to one and the input is x equal to one or you are in state s equal to zero and the uh, input is y equal to zero so like this you can do okay so the answer will be option a okay